how to move youtube channel to another account hello guys and welcome back to the channel in this video i'm going to show you how you can move your youtube channel to another account so let's get started first of all open youtube and then you get to click on your profile here at the top right once you do so you'll be able to see options like these so you get to scroll and click on youtube studio so once you do so you will be redirected to the youtube studio so once you're in the dashboard you get to scroll down at the left side and you get to click on settings and here you'll be able to see the settings menu pop up so you get to click on permissions and you'll be able to see something like this so if you're able to, to see something like this you get to click on close and then you get to click on your account again you'll be able to see a couple of options so you get to head over and click on your channel so once you click on your channel you'll be redirected to your channel and you'll be able to see something like this so you get to click on your profile again scroll down click on settings after that you'll be able to see something like this so you're going to click on add or manage your channel and you're going to create a brand account so simply create a new channel and name it brand account so this is the channel that we just created handy brand account so you're going to click on the profile here at the top right again and make sure you're on the previous channel. To do that, you gotta click on switch account and move to the previous channel again. Now, once you're in this channel again, you gotta click on your profile here once again and head over to settings. So once you're in settings, you'll be able to see something like this. Click on advanced settings over here. And here, you gotta scroll down. You'll be able to see this option that says move channel to a brand account. Simply click on it and you'll be able to see something like this in front of you. So just wait for the interface to get loaded. So once the interface gets loaded, you'll be able to see the transfer channel interface. Scroll down and here you'll be able to see choose an account to move this channel to. So you're going to click on replace. And here you'll be able to see delete this channel. Simply check this box. I understand and wish to proceed. Click on delete channel and make sure you're deleting the channel that you just created. Make sure that this channel is the one that you just created and it's not the previous one or you'll lose all your progress. So you're gonna click on delete channel and then you're gonna click on move channel and then just wait for it to get loaded. And now after that, you're gonna click on this profile again and then you're gonna click on YouTube studio. But before that, you're gonna click on switch account and then you're gonna switch to your previous account. So simply click on it and switch to your previous account and after that, you're going to head over to YouTube Studio. So click on Profile again, go to YouTube Studio, and you'll be redirected to the YouTube Creator Studio. You're going to click on Settings here again. And then you're going to head over to Permissions again. But this time, you will see Manage Permissions and Move Permissions. Like if you recall previously, it was not this over here. So you're going to head over, click on Manage Permissions, and you'll be redirected to this interface. So you're going to click on Manage Permissions again. And after that, you'll be able to see another window pop up in front of you. So you're going to simply verify it. And then you'll be able to see manage permissions like this. So you're going to click on this icon over here that is invite new users and simply type in the new account's email address and choose a role whether you want the new account to be the owner or the manager. Once done, simply select the role and click on invite and accept the invite from the new account. And just like that, that is how you can move one channel to another account. So that's it for today's video. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more helpful tutorials. I'll see you in the next video.